Well, good morning and welcome to your Sunday Gardener. I'm John Collins along with Carrie Angle from Valley View Farms. And our location again today is Fort McHenry. On an absolutely gorgeous day. Right. And uh, we have a flag behind us. It's the Fort McHenry flag, the War of 1812 flag. Something unique about that. 15 stars and 15 stripes. That was what was going on in this country back then. Exactly right. So we've gone back to a 13 star, 13 stripe, but we want to talk about the stars and we're going to talk about some star shaped flowers. Um, and, and there are a lot that are pretty cool. This is Lychnis, and uh, most of these have like five points or so. This is Browalia. We're going to go through this pretty fast. This is a petunia that just has kind of a starburst look to it. This is Santa Cruz begonia. This makes a great hanging basket. They droop. It, it, once they get bigger, they start drooping down. They do a beautiful yeah. job. They grow well in sun or shade. This is ornamental tobacco or Nicotiana. Various that colors. That does beautiful. Yep. Amsonia gets a small blue flower on it, star shaped. Uh, uh -huh. And then the whole plant turns gold for the summer. What's this little guy with the berries? Oh, I'm sorry. This is Hypericum. This one's called Red Star. Um, you can see the outer edge there has five points. And then this uh, berry eventually turns red. It's absolutely really? beautiful. Oh, yep. Okay. Um, over here, then, we also have Penta. That's one of my favorite flowers, and it comes in red and white, so great to use in mm -hmm. your planters. Delphinium, this one, um, and then this is a type of platycodon. This starts out as like a little balloon flower and then opens up into the star shape. Mm -hmm. This is Spigelia, a great perennial for the garden. This is Fuchsia Garden Meister that's great. And some of these just look like fireworks a little bit, so I like that look right, about absolutely. it, too. And then this is Euphorbia. This one's called Breathless. But all beautiful plants yeah, that absolutely. are great to use in planters or in the garden. So, we are at Fort McHenry, and we want to introduce right now Ranger Vince Vays. <laughs> and uh, come on in, Vince. And, uh, hey, Vince. Hey! <laughs> oh, he's all armed and ready to go. What do we got here? Okay, we're not the plant police, all right? <laughs> uh, what we're doing here is talking about Fort Flag Fire. So, every day in the summer months, cannon firing, musket firing some, also flag talks with the Star Spangled Banner flag and Fife and Drum concerts. It's, it's awesome. No, weekends and during the week. So, for the kids, lots of noise. Absolutely. We actually have a special children's area called Citizen Stand, where the kids can try on period clothing, they can color, a lot of neat things. So it's for all ages. All ages. Now, and, and we love our, our, our Fort McHenry pins here. This is fantastic. I'm glad you brought that up because you can be a junior ranger. We have special free junior ranger booklets. The kids can learn, and it's fun learning, and they get a badge just like that when they Pretty get cool. done. I'll guarantee you, kids love the stuff, the activities that go on mm -hmm. here. It's really fascinating. Plus, we get to see this big flag. It's furled out, uh, well, not exactly to our advantage right now, but that's the big one that's usually on display here, right? That's right. And the wind blows a little stronger this summer, so it's going to be standing straight out a little it, bit later. It, it's coming off the water right now, uh, right off the Key Bridge. Uh, there is also a ceremony they do where they lower the flag and the uh, tourists at the time that are in, that's in the right. compound here. Uh, get to actually fold the flag up. Absolutely. Hands on history. Our flag changes. Just look on our website for it. It's all laid out there. Mm -hmm. The flag talks. Hands on history. Get to hold that big flag. And don't forget our social media campaign, uh, hashtag Star Spangled Summer. So you can get a picture of you and the flag or you and these lovely plants and get that out there. It brings everyone together for the Star Spangled Movement. Oh, there we go. <laughs> nice touch. Go back a few years on that yeah. one. 1812 piece. All right, 1812 piece. Yeah. Okay. Ranger Vince, thanks a lot for joining us You're again welcome. this morning at Fort McHenry. Wonderful stuff to see. Don't forget, participate in your own backyard. Some star colored flowers, I think, or shaped there you flowers go. would be great. And Carrie, next Sunday, we'll be back. We'll be at the same location. Okay. We'll be talking about your garden on Sunday Gardener coming up. We'll see you then.